This is our 2013 Winnebago View 24J with just under 60,000 miles. We bought it in Fort Myers, Florida, new in 2013. It has powered adventures all over the US, Canada and Mexico, serving as an aircraft carrier, carrying two paramotors and providing flight to the wares of our whims and sometimes other paragliding shenanigans. After nearly 20 years of trotting about North America in three different motorhomes, we are taking a break. Given that this is supposed to be a good time to be selling, here we are, offering our little mobile slice of paradise for 69,000 minus adjustments covered shortly. No, I'm not very good at marketing because we have not cleaned it from our last trip, but I wanted to get this out there. Hopefully, someone else can start their own adventure. This motorhome is ready to go right now. Nothing needed. But I want prospective buyers to know everything that I know, so there are no surprises. The kitchen serves as a great way to cook food, repair propellers, and do other useful bits. There's a surprising amount of room once the slide is out, but even with the slide in, it's roomy enough to move around in. We chose the dinette arrangement so we could put extra monitors on the table for a truly mobile work at home office. Yes, you can tape monitors to the table and they won't tip over. It has a 3.2 kilowatt Onan diesel generator. That's an expensive option. Propane is standard, but we insisted on diesel to better enable all the boondocking. Propane can be a lot harder to find than diesel. The generator runs great. So great that it requires pulling this knob to stop. In 2019, it quit responding to the shutoff signal. Camping World of Tampa installed this cure after explaining that it would otherwise cost about $2,000 for an overhaul of the generator. It would also fix a small amount of oil drip, but it's something we could endure. We have discounted the price by $2,000 as a result of this. The Natic Guide suggests average retail with the included options of 68,970, call it 69K. You can see all the items on the list. We think most actual humans would value GPS navigation at only about $100 given the ubiquity of phone apps, so have reduced it by another $2,000. Probably more useful than the navigation, though, is satellite radio and working Bluetooth. The backup camera works through the dash radio, too. That brings it down to 65K. We never once watched over-the-air TV, so don't know if that works. Same with AM FM radio. There are two missing antennas up top, although the TV antenna is there. Assume they will need to be replaced. There is some minor plastic damage, and one of the plastic skirt braces came off, but it seems still plenty strong. 
On the counter where the kitchen faucet is, there is some minor water damage. It's been repaired, but you can still see it. The MCD double blinds at the dinette need to be replaced. There is a small repaired crack on the windshield, low and in front of the driver. There will be other small insults, the results of seven years of play. For these things, we're reducing the price by another 3K. That brings the price down to 62000 Remember, the starting price was for a used motorhome. It's never perfect. In 2017, it got a bunch of new stuff on top after a hailstorm. We were in it. That was fun. But the insurance rocked, and it actually came out ahead. It has very handy cab blinds that all work. It drives as well as the day we bought it, with the normal amount of squeaks, rattles, and vibrations that are endemic of moving apartments. It likes 63 mile per hour, but will certainly go faster. We had tire inflators added to make inflation easier of the dualies. The tires are less than two years old, as best we can remember. On our very first trip out, we added a sewer hose carrier since one is not included. Apparently, you're supposed to carry this nastiness in a bin. There is a 2-inch receiver, and you can get all the specs on the motorhome online. The title calls it a 2013 model, but it's built on a 2012 Sprinter chassis. It is one of Winnebago's most popular products. Since we are only interested in very serious buyers, we're treating it like a yacht. No test drives unless someone is otherwise committed to buying it. Sorry about that, but time is our most precious commodity. And thanks for your interest.